Hey, this is Vegeta, the Prince of All Saiyans, and this is SSJ Goshen 4. Her figures are over 9,000! Hey guys, this is Goshen 4 here, back again with a new video for you guys, and today I got another fan mail unboxing for you, Dragon Ball fan mail. And uh, I got a couple things for you guys um, that you guys sent to me, so thank you, thank you so much once again, Goshen Force, for sending anything to me. I appreciate every little thing you guys send to me, no matter how small or big it is, so thank you. Um, so, with that said, let's open up the first box. First one is, um, I'm not sure who it's from, but it says, Omo Yari Sweet, I don't know. It's from somebody. So let's check it out. This little Amazon box over here. Let's check it out. Check it out. Oh! <laughs> oh, that's so cool. <laughs> I've been wanting this one. I've been wanting this one. Nice. For a while. I think this is from Tim. I think so. Uh, thank you so much. I think I told you that I was looking for this one. So. That means a lot to me that you actually sent it to me. Like that's great. I really, really love this Frieza, the the BWFC one, the Van Presto World Figure Coliseum First Form Frieza. It's such a good one. It really is such a good one. This one's sculpted by. Ooh, the, it's blocking the person, but um, I don't know what country this one is from. To be honest with you, because it's blocking here, but. Nonetheless, such a great figure. I've seen it displayed and it's so beautiful. So thank you. Thank you so much. I love it. I love it. Now this one's going to be like a short like unboxing because like there's not too too much fan mail this week. But um, still enough to make a video I suppose. I try to go to the P.O. Box every week to open up the stuff you guys send me. So this one is from... Oh, this is from... This is from Tim. For sure I know that. Let's see what it is. Uh oh, I didn't even open it. I didn't even open it properly. Okay, let's see. Oh, haha. <laughs> yes, yes, this is so cool. Okay, so I originally was gonna purchase them from him, but he said, don't worry about it, it's fine. Like, you bought something else from me, so you could just, you know, have these. Um, I'll just give them to you, so I really. I'm thankful for that. That was really, really nice of you. So in this, we got two Dragon Ball Adverge little mini figures. So I went, the minute I saw the Ultra Instinct, the Master Ultra Instinct Goku and the Jiren, I was like, yes, because I'm a fan of both, to be honest with you. I love Jiren, and I actually really love um, Master Ultra Instinct. So take a look at these guys. Pretty awesome figures, right? They look sick as hell. So um, I was super, super hyped. Uh, when I saw these so thank you so much for sending them my way. I really appreciate it Tim These are really really nice quality little mini figures really they are so cute They're kind of chibi looking too, which I like so yes got more Jiren got more master ultra stick in my collection now this one uh, Here's another one. Let's check out this one. Oh Crap, I think I almost broke the package. Ha! Oh my god. Oh my god, well the pa- Holy shit, the box is open. The package is open. Um, it came open at least. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, I'll show you what it came in. But, um, I think I opened the back then actually. No, it was open. It was open already. It's fine. They're fine to display without this package. I don't need this stupid thing. So it says, Ma maquetas? Ma maquetas. I don't know what that means. I'm guessing it's like a little... This is Mexican. This is straight up Mexican, but I think maquetas, I don't know what that means. If it's a brand or whatever. No, it's, this is not a brand. This is, these are bootleg figures, but I don't know what that means. <laughs> Maybe it's like some kind of like little goodie toys. I don't fucking know, but okay, we got the most hideous figures of, I've seen, or some of them. Actually, this one's pretty nice, but this one's horrible. This one, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, speaking of Ultra Instinct and Jiren. Okay, oh, this one, let's see this one. Oof, these are all so bad. <laughs> is that it? Oh my god, this is great. Alright, alright y'all. So in this was this horrible Jiren. It smells like 
lead. I don't know. I'm gonna die from lead poisoning. Just saying. Just kidding. But uh, it has a strong odor to it. You never know. Hey. But anyways, look. This is freaking Jiren. Look at Jiren. Look at that face. Y'all, look. He has like buck teeth. I don't know if you can see that, but he literally has some buck teeth. Can you see that? Can you like take a get a good look at that? He has like two front teeth sticking out. It looks like I don't know, but that's pretty bad. <laughs> take a look at the 17. That has to be such a hideous. Look at that 17. Never seen one so bad. Look at these guys. Look at Bucktooth Jiren. Look at this. I don't even know. Horrible, horrible 17. He reminds me of like one of the members from the Gang Green Gang. Like the main one. I forgot his name. <laughs> oh, it's so bad. These are horrible, but so good at the same time because they're so bad. Oh yeah, there's another one here. Okay, I dropped one. I found them. Okay. Mastered Ultra Instinct Goku over here. Look at that. Look at him. This one's actually, I don't know. This one's all, it's bad, but it's like not as bad as the other ones maybe. Or maybe it is. It's pretty bad, but I like it. I got a boot like Mastered Ultra Instinct figure. That's amazing. That's amazing. Here is, this is horrible, horrible. This is freaking Whis. Look at this Whis. This is such a horrendous Whis. Look at that. Look at that. You call this Whis. This is Whis. It is so freaking horrible. That face. What's wrong with him? What is literally wrong with Whis? Oh my god. And we got Zeno, which this one's like, it's bad, but it's alright, I guess. It is bad, but. The other ones are, are worse, definitely. <laughs> still, still pretty bad though. And this one, I must say, is the best out of the bunch. It is Master Roshi. Okay, you cannot tell me that this is not the best one out of all the ones I showed you. This one's actually pretty good, though. I think it's actually pretty decent. This uh, Roshi. So this is my favorite out of all of them because he looks not horrible. He looks like he could be, you know, displayed with other figures and not look super out, out of place because he doesn't look that bad so this one's the best one so that was it from uh that lot of freaking mexican figures i really like that that was fun that was great <laughs> you know i always love freaking like bootleg mexican stuff so good so good i love it i love it <laughs> because they're like so bad some of them i just i facepalm because it's like how 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 does one make something that horrible but Whatever, alright. So thank you so much for sending that to me. Um, I really love it. I love it. Like I said, from how small it is, whatever you send me, from small to like something big, it doesn't matter. It doesn't, it doesn't have to be big, but I'm saying like, I like e everything. Like it's so cool that you do that. Like you go take the time to pick out something and send it my way and so I can show it on video for you guys. It's just amazing. Ocean Force is awesome. But uh, before I conclude this, I do want to open one thing because I, I did not want to make a separate unboxing video for this because it's literally only one package. And I'm like really excited to open it so I don't want to wait for more packages to come. So I'm just going to open it on this video. So I kind of know what this is, but I didn't expect it to be like this small. It seems like it's pretty small. But um, I'm not going to tell you. I'm going to open it up first. Alright y'all. Okay. Oh, I love it. I'm so happy. Like, actually, I'm so happy I don't have anything beers that's like a plushie. Alright, y'all. Look at this awesome fucking plush. It's a Beerus plush. Ooh, he's so cutie. Look. Okay, so the minute I saw this, I'm like, I want it. I freaking want it. I want it so bad. And guess what? It's not a fake or anything. It's, it is real. It's a real licensed plushie of Beerus. Like, look at him. Oh, you can put him right next to Zeno. You can't really see him in the frame, but he's down here like this. Oh, he's so cutie. I love it. I, I really always wanted a Beerus plush. And I saw this and I'm like, yo, I need it. I've been, I was so excited to open it. Cause I was like, Beerus, they don't have Beerus plushies. Why? Like he's cute, like and cuddly. He can be, I mean, he looks like really pissed. Like right here, like <laughs> he's like, why am I a plushie? Lord Beerus should not be a plushie, but he looks so cute. Oh my god. And um, it's very interesting. Oh, here's his little. Because um, I wasn't sure, if, like, I was actually trying to figure out if this was a real licensed 
like item or some kind of fan made thing or like like a custom or something like that but it looks like it's real it says Toei Animation it says Bird Studios Toei Animation it says Dragon Ball Super on the tag it has a tag and it has all licensing stuff on it this is I believe I don't where did I get this from again I think it's um it's oh it says Spain it's from Spain I believe then it looks like it at least. I don't know. I'm confused from where this is from exactly, but it's not from the States or nothing like that. But um, I'll show you like the tag real quick so you can see that it is legit. So you take a look at that tag. It is a real tag. It says by Play by Play. That's the brand it looks like. And it says Toei Animation. So yep, take a look at that. Real item. And guess what? I found a... um. Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta from the same brand of this Beerus. So they have this Beerus and they have uh, Blue Vegeta. I don't know who else they probably have. That would be great if they had Whis because, oh my god, that would be so awesome to have him and Whis together. But I got Beerus! Beerus the Destroyer! <laughs> He's so cute! He's so adorable. He's so angry. Look at Beer is so angry. I wanna pose him with pudding. I wanna pose him with pizza. <laughs> but yeah, we got freaking Beer is plushy. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed this edition of Dragon Ball Fan Mail with Goshen. And once again, thank you so much for sending me anything, you guys. I appreciate it so so much. And you don't have to buy me anything. You don't. You can send me a freaking card you have laying around in your house if you want to. You can send me a note, a letter, a fan art. You don't have to, like, spend money. You don't. I'm not... You know, you really do not. You could just send me a drawing and I would love it. I, I'm trying to keep a folder with all the fan arts that I get, so... I love you guys. Scotia Force is so, so great. If you guys would like to send me anything, I will put the address to my P.O. box in the description below. Check out the address to my P.O. Box and see your item on video. Beer says, check out the P.O. Box address in the description to send anything to the P.O. Box. Bruh. But yeah, I'm really loving Beer, like, as you can tell. <laughs> I love it. I love it. He's so cute. He's so cute. Okay, for real now. Thank you once again, Goshen Force. Love you guys. You want to see your fan art or anything you send to me on camera, send it down there to the P.O. Box. And until my next video, guys, peace. Hey, it's Pan from Dragon Ball GT. And you're watching my good friend, SSJ Goshen 4. Yeah!